Hello everyone, I'm Carl from Arduino and today I'm going to show how to sync your phone's sensor data with the Arduino IoT Cloud. Smartphones have a lot of embedded sensors. Uh, it has a light sensor, it has an accelerometer, it has a GPS tracker among other sensors. So this data can be accessed uh, through the IoT remote app and then be synchronized to the Arduino IoT Cloud. And this means that you can actually synchronize your phone with an, another Arduino device. So essentially using the phone as an input. So I got the app installed here on my phone and I'm logged in with my account. Once you're done setting that up, you will be taken to a dashboard. And here you should be prompted uh, if you want to enable it in background mode. And this basically allows your, your phone to send sensor data to the Arduino IoT Cloud uh, without having the app open. Uh, so I'm gonna activate that feature. So the next step, and we're gonna do something fun here, is to use that as an input to turn on and off this light here. Basically, if we do this, it's going to send the data and it's gonna register that something is, is happening, like some threshold is met, and then it's gonna turn on the lights. Uh, and whenever we do the same motion, it's gonna turn off the light as well. In order to do so, we need to synchronize variables. So we need to synchronize the variable we have on the phone, which contains the accelerometer data, and we need to synchronize it with the Arduino device, which is going to activate the relay. So let's test it out. I've now synchronized the variables. Uh, and in theory now, if I pick up the phone and I make a rapid movement, uh, we're going to see the light here come on. So we're going to test it out. And to switch it off. Ah, that's great. And that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, hope you get some inspiration for your next project.